In this case study, we look at a number of ways that Google Docs encourages two key steps in the web behavior chain, creating value and involving others. One of the key aspects of Docs is that it makes it easy to create documents and share them with others. Google first makes it e very easy to create value by making it simple to either create a new document or, in this case, upload a previously existing document. The user can thus easily add content to their Docs page for collaboration. Once a document has been created or uploaded, Google pushes the collaborative aspects of their platform front and center. It gives the user a link right on the main page to share his document with other users. The user has now created value. Let's look at how Docs gets other people involved. Clicking on the Share Now link or the Collaborate tab opens a number of ways to let other users work on the same document or to allow them to view the document as well. As we add a collaborator and a viewer, Google accomplishes a key component of the behavior chain, involving others. In this example, we will invite one collaborator who will work on the document and one viewer to have read-only access. Once these other people have been added, Google makes it very easy to notify them of the service. This accomplishes two goals. First, it makes it easy to work in teams, which is one of the key features that Google Docs presents over traditional competitors like Microsoft Office. But second, it also invites these users to become users of Google Docs themselves, thus expanding the user base of Google Docs. Not only does this invite others to experience the user's creations, it also invites them to try out the service if they previously have not. After having invited users, Google shows which people have access to the document. Google encourages the user to repeatedly visit their document by showing who last edited it. If one of the collaborators was the last person to edit the document, it entices the user to see what has changed. Google offers one more way to involve others to Docs. By clicking on the Publish link, Google allows the user to share their collaboratively created content with the universally accessible URL. At the bottom of this document is a message saying that the document was created by Google Docs. In this way, Google offers multiple levels of user involvement to become involved with their Docs product. For collaborators, Docs encourages users to sign up for the service. For people only casually interested in the service, coming upon a published document gives them a good, low-impact way to learn about the service. Google Docs is a great case study on, on the ways to move users along the behavior chain. The service makes it simple and easy to create value by making it easy to create documents or upload already existing documents. And the service is built around the next step of the behavior chain, involving others. By making it easy to both collaborate and publish, Docs is a great example of how to expand the scope of one's product beyond the registered user base.